Hey everyone, it's me, Sydney, also known as Fashion Barbie 16. Today I'm going to be doing a Get Ready With Me casual edition. So the first thing I'm doing right here is taking my HD Rimmel London uh, quad in Purple Rain 006 and applying it to my lids and applying the whitish color to my inner corner. Now, as you guys can see, I'm like touching it up and everything. I'm just, I put a base the base color on there which was the lighter purple and now I'm putting the darker and I'm highlighting my inner crease like I was doing so you know I'm just fixing all of that now I'm applying some gel liner from forever 21 which is their love and beauty collection I'm still working on this stuff so um, yeah I did not know it was out of focus when the time when I was doing this so just don't judge okay I love you guys but don't judge so as I'm doing this, I'm just trying to, you know, do a bold line instead of a thin line. I'm not good at thin lines. So that's what I'm doing right here. And I don't have a mirror, so that's, <laughs> I mean, I had a mirror, but it wasn't like close to me. So that was the best I could do with this. And then I go to the mirror. Okay, so now that's the finished, like, eye look. Now we're on to the lips. So for the lips, I'm just applying some Bag Balm, and I'm just like applying Bag Balm, which is something I love. And next, I'm taking the e.l.f., and this is like a cream lipstick or something, in the shade Coral, and it's matte, by the way. And I'm applying that also to my cheeks, because I just wanted a little bit of a glow, but not like a huge one. And I'm just taking a round cotton thingamajigger. And I'm just rubbing that against because I didn't need a sponge. I just needed some cotton or something. So now I'm taking a base, which should be on my eyelids, but I put that under my eyelids where my dark circles are. I know it doesn't look like I have them, but I have little ones, and I wanted to just prime that area before I put the concealer on. So now I'm going to be taking the CoverGirl concealer and concealing that area. And you know, I totally have to make it look less dark. But I swear I blended it out after I did that, so don't be all like, Cindy, you did not blend that. Because I did. Um, then I'm just taking the Voluminous Lashes by L'Oreal, I'm pretty sure. And this is like their really old one, so this is not like their gold packaging. This is like the black packaging from a long time ago but it's a different brush and everything so yeah so I'm just doing that I didn't even curl them so I was kind of proud of myself and I just wanted a more natural eyelash look and everything so that worked out in my favor I hope that you guys like this voiceover I'm like learning how to do that still so you know I like talking to you guys while I'm seeing my mascara get done so now I'm doing the bottom lashes and I just wanted to give them a little bit of definition, but not like crazy dragon lady eyelashes, you know. So now I'm going to be applying, I'm going to be highlighting my brow bone. And I did not highlight anything else, just my brow bone. So, you know, that worked out. And I'm just using a, the color workshop. Yeah, I'm using the color workshop quad, which was in like a whitish color. And then now I'm just making it look more natural and everything like that. And now I'm just singing to myself like a crazy lady. Yay. Putting my glasses on. All right, now my hair is down. And I'm just going to brush it out because it was a little bit naughty looking. And, you know, I just brought, brushed it out. And as you guys can tell, I have, like, really awkward, like, flat and wavy hair. Like, who else has that type of hair where on one side it's wavy and the other side it's flat? Do you see that? Do you guys see that? So now I have my PJs on and I just put some pair of sweats on because this is casual. But then I just dressed it up a little bit with the top, which was from JCPenney. And it's hot here now, so it's, you know, a little bit, like I need something a little bit less warm. And now I have my jewelry and this is actually from, well, my nail polish is from... OPI and that perfume is Sweet Day which is a knockoff of 
Someday by Justin Bieber, and it smells just the same. And I spray a lot on because I love it. And I spray it on my hair because when I flip my hair, I want them to smell it. So I love you guys so much. Talk to you guys later. Bye.